Hi guys, it's Friday. Hope you guys are doing well. We have a little no repeat workout today. You're gonna grab a medicine ball if you have it, or a dumbbell. One dumbbell is fine. It's gonna be great, so no repeats. Total of, look, we got 15 different moves today. Something like that. Happy Friday, guys. We made it to the end of the week. We did it, right? So, again, if you're on, say hi. I see someone's on, can't tell who it is. But, welcome, guys. Welcome, welcome. So, medicine ball, if you have one, all right? If you don't have an actual, like, weighted medicine ball, you can even use, like, a soccer ball or, I don't know, some type of ball that you have in your house. Um, but if you don't have one, totally okay. Use a dumbbell. I can show you different things um, with the dumbbell as well. All right? So, yeah, no repeats today. It's going to be awesome. We're just going to flow through our exercises. And then uh, it's the weekend, right? So, we'll give another few seconds before we get started. How is everyone doing? I feel like this week was a long one, but... Hey, we are halfway through August, so I mean, the summer is just like flying by. Shout out to my sister for the shorts today. <laughs> I stole them from her, uh, her closet, so she's gone to college, so it's fine. She didn't pack them, so I'm just gonna take them for myself, right? So, make sure you guys have water, okay? So water with you. We'll drink here. Good stuff. Alrighty, are you ready for this? I'm ready. So, let's get started. A little warm up. Alright, let's just start nice and easy with just marches in place, okay? So I want you to get those arms moving. So I want you to drive the knees up, keep the core nice and tight. Again, just kind of warm up the lower body, getting the blood pumping, a little midday workout for you. Good. Stand tall here. Very nice. And from here we got our standing hamstring curls. All right, little butt kickers. Again, use those arms back and forth. All right, bring the heel towards your butt. Yeah, we'll start slow and then we'll kind of work our way up just to get that heart rate up. We got some strength, we got some cardio, we got some core, we got it all today. Good, all right, reach over to the side. All right, a little gentle upper stretch here. Good. Nice job. Again, take your time. If you want to hold that stretch on one side, you can. There you go. Nice job. Keep those legs nice and wide. All right, we're going to reach for the center of our toes. All right, so slowly just kind of lower down. Kind of stretch the back out a little bit. Let the head hang. Let those arms hang. Relax your neck. Good. I want you to shift into one side. Reach up to the foot, and then you're walking over to the other side. So we're going to switch. Just keep going here as you're hanging down. Feel so that stretch in the back. Stretch in the back of those legs. Good. All right, you ready to stand? Come back to center. Stand all the way up. Nice and tall. Roll those shoulders back. And we got a little jog. I ran really far today. <laughs> so my legs are like, oh my gosh, my calves are so tight. Yikes. All right, little jog here, shake it out. So let's go to our butt kickers, all right? So, heels towards the butt, all right, as we're jogging here. Hopefully you're finding that breathing's getting a little bit quicker. We got the heart rate going up, getting hot. Nice. Awesome job. All right, we're gonna do some squats here for me. So, feet up, shoulder width apart. You're gonna sink down nice and deep and then come back up. So nice and easy, drive through with those heels. All right, stand tall, get them warm with the legs, those hips, good. Awesome job, you're doing two more, all right? So two more where you're at, and once you're done, you're joining me for some jumping jacks. So, jacks here, good. Again, if you wanna be tap side to side, you're not feeling that, go for it, all right? Nice job. Those arms up overhead. Good. Breathing. Good work, good work. Nice job. All right, relax. We're going to work our way to the floor. So, we got our inchworms, all right? One of my favorite ways to get down. 
So hinge at the hips, slight bend in those legs. You're gonna walk those hands out. All right, nice high plank position here. You're gonna give me five push-ups, okay? So wherever you're at, you need to go to your knees, go to your knees. If not, you have five, then you're gonna hold. All right, hold that high plank. And then you're gonna walk your hands back up towards your feet. Stay up nice and tall. Arms up overhead. We're gonna go back down. All right, you have 10 mountain climbers. So in and out with those mountain climbers for 10. Then you're gonna hold. Good, and then we're gonna push back just with that downward dog. Just kinda get a deeper stretch. Those hamstrings, back, calves. Good, reset to high plank. And let's walk those feet, or those hands, back up towards your feet. Stand up nice and tall. We're gonna go back to our jog. All right, let's do some arm circles in there. So we're gonna do some forward arm circles. So again, try to get that full range of motion. All right, all the way around. Good, let's go backward. Good, again, kind of work out those kinks and across our chest. Good, nice job, guys. All right, one last thing for me, and we're gonna do some sumo squats, just kind of get those hips open a little bit more. So legs out nice and wide, toes on an angle, you're squatting down. And then back up. Squeeze the butt when you get to the top. Good. Nice job. Two more here. Got one. And two. Nice job. All right. I want you guys to take a few seconds, shake it out, okay? What we got for today, like I said, medicine ball. If you have a medicine ball, all right, ours is like 12, so. We'll see how that goes. I also have a dumbbell here with me to show you some dumbbell movements, okay? You can substitute if you don't have um, a medicine ball, okay? No repeats. So, we have three different sets. We have kind of like a hit set. We got some cardio strength mixed in. We're gonna break for core in between. And then we got another 10 minute kind of segment at the end, all right? Each exercise is gonna be for one minute, okay? So one minute, that's all you got. And then we're moving on, all right? So. One time through every exercise, I'm gonna kind of show you. We're gonna have like 15 second break in between, but I'm gonna kind of show you those moves before that, like the previous ones up, so you kind of get an idea what we're doing. Okay, so take your time. All right, challenge yourself here. Have fun. Push yourself, and let's get this Friday. All right. So grab that ball. We're gonna do a little squat press. All right. So you're squatting down to the side. Press up. All right. So squat press as you come back to the center. All right, to increase that pace, I want you kind of moving through this pretty quickly. All right, and then we got little med ball skaters to come up next, and I will show you that. So, grab your ball again. Grab a weight, same thing, dumbbell, pressing, totally fine. So we have one minute of work. You ready? I'm ready, and let's get it going. It's coming down, up. Good, so drive straight up. All right, sing so nice and deep. Into that squat, keep that core tight. You got shoulders back here. Oh, I hit my fan. Sorry, mom. I'm gonna break the fan here. Again, come back to the center. Every time, press that weight. And if any point gets heavy for you, just drop that weight, okay? You can still squat and still press up and get that same work, all right? So feel free to do that. All right, here we go. We're over halfway. You got this. Remember, you're only doing this once. Let's make it count while we're in it. Good. Come on. Heart rate's up. Press that weight towards the ceiling. Almost there. We got five more seconds. All right. Three, two, one. Relax. Here we go. This is, we're going to rest here. So this is what we're doing next. A little speed skater. Bring that ball to the outside every time, okay? You ready? One minute, and let's go. So a little lateral movement here. That weight is being kind of pulled side to side, engage the core. Again, if you need to rest your foot behind you as you land, go for it. All right, stabilize as fast as you're able to with control. I work those outer glutes and thighs, right? Side to side. Ooh, keep that 
that chest tall. Alright. This is a good one to keep that core right in check. We're always using our core, but this one really helps us work it. Good. Come on. Finish strong here. How fast can you go? Push hard for 15 more seconds, okay? You can do it. Again, if you have that dumbbell, you're holding that dumbbell. Good. Nice job. Almost there. Keep working. Three, two, one, and relax. All right, as you're resting here, toe taps like a soccer ball, all right? Bring in that foot, all right? Those toes on top of that ball. You ready? One minute. Here we go. So, if you don't want to touch the ball, that's fine. You can just kind of touch the air. I'm going to speed up. Okay, if you have a dumbbell, same thing. All right. You lay on your toes. If you don't want to do that jump, right here's your modification. All right. Taps. Use the arms. All right, you're on. On your toes. Good. Come on. Push here. Remember, core tight. We're only doing this once. All right. If you want to add a little challenge, go around the circle. All right. Good. Yeah. Come on, guys. 15 more seconds. You're doing great. Toe taps. Good. Breathe in through your nose. Out through your mouth. You got five. Good. Three, two, one. And relax. Good stuff. Medicine ball push ups. So, one hand is going to be on the medicine ball. You're going to go down for a push up. You're going to pass to your other side. Push up. Option to go to your knees if you need to. Okay? Find a spot on the ground. You ready? You're going to switch arms each time. Here we go. So, one arm on top. Go down to where you can. Again, a little challenge here. Got some core work as you pass that ball. Good. Good. Dig deep here. You don't have to rush it here. Alright? So, if you need to go to your knees, this is what this looks like. Come in here. Down. Upper and lower body go down together, right? So I always say. 30 more seconds. Alright, we're halfway. Good. Dig deep. Get low. One arm on the ball. Pass. Again, if you just have a dumbbell, you're just doing regular push-ups, right? Sorry, I forgot to mention that. Alright. Breathe. Work that chest. Come on. You got it. Good. Five more seconds. What do you got? Oh, good. And relax. Alright, watch me here. Backward lunge. You're going to pass that ball three times around and step. All right, then you got the other side. Okay? And up. You ready? Here we go. So lunge back. Get low. Pass that ball or that weight three times around. And back. All right, so get low. Try to keep that back knee off the ground. Again, challenge yourself here. A little strength. Whew. All right? You don't have to. You can just do backward lunges. Okay? Good. Nice job. Stand tall. Keep that knee right over that ankle, right? Woo! Hit my leg. <laughs> We're over halfway, guys. Come on. Three passes. And up. Good. Come on. You got this. Stay focused again. You're passing that dumbbell. We have a dumbbell. We have 10 more seconds. Keep breathing. How are those legs feeling? Nice. Three, two, one, and relax. Okay, so we're gonna do a little burpee here with the ball at a bicep curl. You're gonna go down, out here. As you come up, bicep curl. So out, in, and curl. Okay, so one minute. Are you ready? And let's get started. So be careful. As you go out in that ball, all right, make sure that ball is nice and steady. Coming up, legs go out, add a bicep curl at the top. If you need to, walk your feet out, walk your feet back in, 
Go for it. All right? Come on. Push your pace. You got this. All right, dig deep. Outside good high plank position. Stand tall at the top. Nice. Come on, you got 20 more seconds. Dig deep. Good. On that heart rate should be going, right? Nice work, nice work. Okay, last 10 here, last 10. How many more reps can you get in here? Be careful, three, two, and one. All right, nice job, we're gonna go to the ground. Medicine ball passes, so, balls out in front, all right? You're passing, one side to the other, all right? Keep those hips squared to the ground. You ready? We have one minute. And here we go. If you need to go to your knees, go to your knees. All right, challenge yourself. The further that ball rolls through your body, right, the harder it's gonna be to catch and stabilize. Keep the shoulders right underneath those, hit right above the hands, all right? Widen that stance with those feet if you need to. All right, you got this. Squeeze your butt. Good, come on. Dig deep here. Breathe. Pass that ball, man. I'm sweating here. Good. Back and forth across. You're doing awesome. You got 20 more seconds. All right, 20 seconds. Good. Nice work, nice work. Here we go. You got 10. Keep working for 10. Keep that core going. Good. Almost there. Three, two, one, and relax. All right, we're gonna flip on over. We're gonna do hip bridges on the ball. Your option to do single leg, which is gonna be a little bit harder, or double leg. You're gonna look like this. All right? Up and down. All the way up, push up through the heels and back. All right, you ready? One minute and go. Again, if you don't have medicine ball, just do regular bridges. Again, single leg's gonna be a little bit harder. All right, you're gonna work those hamstrings a little bit. It's gonna require some control because that ball's gonna move, right? So, take your time. I want you to hold the top. Squeeze, butt, hamstrings, and down. Good. Make sure you come all the way up, get those hips high, and then touch back down to the ground. You're doing great, we're halfway here. All right, breathe. We got one more exercise. Keep pushing, this is fun, right? No repeats. You're like, once you finish it, you're done. Woohoo! Always a good feeling, right? Come on, keep pushing. Feel in the back. Work here, we have 10. Nice, good job. Three, two, one. Last exercise here. All right, you're just gonna hold that ball as we're running. All right, we got a little jog in place as you hold that medicine ball up close to you. You ready? 60 seconds, we'll take a break, and we'll move on to our core. All right, ready? And join me, here we go. All right, challenge, hold out. All right, so jog in place, little weighted jog here, light on those toes, right? Keep that core tight, come on. All right, bring those knees up. Not a full high knee, but again, out here is gonna be a little bit harder. All right, bring it in close to your chest. It's gonna be a little bit easier. We're just going quick feet here. All right, how fast can you go? How long should we get that heart rate up? I'm like watching myself on the screen. I look so goofy. <laughs> it's all right, we're doing this together, right? Come on, almost there. Good job, good job. Breathe, holding that ball. Come on, you got this. Good. Last 15 seconds, okay? Keep working. Keep that ball up. Try not to rest it against your body, all right? Keep it out, all right? Three, two, and one. All righty. Nice job. Set that ball on the ground with that weight. Grab some water. How are we feeling, all right? Again, we're done with those exercises, so it's great. We are gonna do some core in between, all right, before we move on to our last set. You're gonna find me on the ground, okay? We're gonna do 
each core thing for 45 seconds, okay? So I'll keep track of time. You don't, got, you don't have to worry about it. That's on me here. All right, first exercise, we've got single leg crunches. You're going to start on the ground here all the way flat. Ball or dumbbell overhead. As you come up, you're crunching. We're going to do one leg at a time, all right? Crunch. Actually, let's do this, yeah. Let's bring that ball over that knee on one side. So halfway, we're going to switch and do the other leg, okay? Again, if you just want to do a regular sit-up, that's a good modification to do as well. So 45 seconds. Ready? And here we go. So coming up, overhead, crunch. Drive that knee in towards your chest. Breathe out as you crunch in. Again, if you don't want to use that ball, don't use that ball. All right? You can just use body weight, that's fine. We've got a few more reps here. Good, let's switch. All right, so when you can, crunch, bring that other leg in. Use that core to get you up and to bring that knee in towards your body. Come on, you got this. Yeah, 10 more seconds. Feel that core? Good. And we got a little back exercise too, a little back pullover. I like it. And relax. All right, watch me here. Your ball is going to go right between your thighs. All right, you're going to squeeze that ball. All right, as hard as you can. If you don't have the ball again, just pretend, okay? So we're going to do reverse crunches. So what this is going to look like here, you're just dropping your heels down towards the floor and then bringing them back in. All right, so a little drop. And here. You ready? Here we go. So again, squeeze that ball to work those adductors. Again, be careful. My ball's slipping because I'm, sl uh, I'm a little slutty. But again, ball in between your legs. Drop the heels towards the ground. Keep that lower back on the ground, okay? Press into that floor. Keep that core engaged. Got some leg work too in here. Nice job. If you need to adjust, you can adjust. All right. Nice. So feel that core braced the whole time. All right. That tight core is going to drive that back to the floor. Good work. Good work. How are those legs feel? I'm squeezing that ball. Yeah. Three, two, one. Whoo. And relax. We're going to stay down here. Okay. Dead bugs. So let's see how this is going to work here. What I want you to do, you're going to lower one leg here at a time as you're holding that weight above your head, okay? So for 45 seconds, you ready? And here we go. So arms straight up, legs are up, you're dropping one leg at a time, all right? Again, just a glass exercise. Make sure that lower back is glued to the floor, okay? So if you can't lower all the way down to the ground, don't lower all the way to the ground, all right? As you can tell, my hamstrings are very tight, so my legs are not that straight, all right, but my low back is in check here. Glue to the ground. Nice. Breathe. All right, you're doing great. Good stuff, good stuff. Keep holding that weight above your head. All right, we have five more seconds. Good. And relax. All right, we're going to flip on over here. So your thing here, plank on the ball. Hands can be on the ball. Or if you want feet to be on the ball, feet can be on the ball as well. Alrighty? So, this is what it's going to look like. You're going to hold. Alright? Or, if you want to rest your feet on the ball, that's going to be a little bit trickier. So, for 45 seconds, we're going to hold our plank. If you're not comfortable doing either, hold a regular plank. Okay? Ready? And, here we go. So, here's front ways here. So, stack it in. You can even make little circles with the ball. Be careful, though. Kind of take off your balance a little bit. Try to keep those legs close together, all right? Because the wider your legs are, the easier it's going to be. So if you're a little close, it's going to be a little bit more challenging. Again, you're here. If you want a little bit of deeper challenge, be careful. All right? Your feet are going to be on the ball, and you're holding. All right? We're about halfway. So whatever kind of plank you want to be in, all right? Hold here. Breathe. Squeeze the glutes. Squeeze that core, lock in here. You've got this, we got one more exercise. Three, two, one, and relax. Good, we're gonna go to our side here. I'm just like 
gripping and sweat. All right, a little side crunch. All right, your legs gonna be on the ground. You're gonna have, have your arm bent here. While you're doing, you're crunching up as you're bringing your leg towards you. Your side crunch here, leg straight. Weight is gonna be on your leg, okay? So for 45, we're gonna do half on each side, ready? And let's begin. So, leg straight out, do a little crunch up and down. So try to use that outer core right here, those obliques, not, not really pushing up with that hand. All right, a little bit maybe, but body's nice and straight, crunching up. It's like a V up from the side, right? Good, nice job. All right, you ready to switch? Here we go, let's switch sides. All right, so we got about 22-ish seconds on this side. All right, legs stacked. When you're ready, join me, all right? So coming up and down, breathe. Again, without the weight, you're gonna do the same thing, all right? You can still do that side crunch without that weight on your leg, okay? Good, so you should feel right here. All right, come it up. Good. Got 10 more seconds. Keep working. Good. We got three, two, one, and relax. All right, guys. That is all for the core specific part. So grab some water. We got one more set through here. All right, we are going to do, we have what, 10 exercises, maybe? Something like that. All right, one minute each. All right, we're going through, no repeats. So let's get it started here. I'm gonna reset my watch, all right? First one, we're doing swings. All right, one of my favorites. Ball comes back and through, all right? Butt goes back, you're driving through, that power comes through those hips, all right? Squeeze the butt when you get to the top, all right? Same thing, dumbbell, grab a dumbbell, you're doing the same thing. If you don't have any weights, right here, okay? So. One minute of those, and I'll show you what we're doing next. You ready? And let's get it started. Here we go. So I want you to go, you may not have, like mine's only 12 pounds, right, for this weight. I'm gonna try to go a little bit faster, all right? I'm gonna try to get as many reps in here as I can. Good form, but I'm gonna push the pace here. All right, so you're gonna do it once. All right, the weight's not too terribly heavy. Good, swing through. Keep that core braced, right? Butt's tight when you get to the top. Good work, good work, come on. Good. You got this. Breathe. Nice. There we go, drive through. One minute, you need anything for a minute. You got 15 seconds left of it, all right? So again, those legs are out wide. Coming through. Nice job. Good, five more seconds. Nice, and relax, good. All right, we're gonna keep going in with it. We got thrusters, okay? Squat with a press. Add a little throw. You wanna try a little mid-ball throw? Here you come down, throw, and catch. All right, be careful though, all right? We don't want any injuries on my watch. You ready? You got 60 seconds. Throwing is optional, okay? Just do that squat press if you need. And. Let's go. I'm just moving over here so I have some space with that fan. Again, come down. Try to make it one fluid movement. Even if you're not throwing it, right? You're coming up and down. Find that rhythm. Be careful as you're throwing. Be careful as you're catching. All right? Good. Weight back in the heels. Drive up. And just flat down. Good. Here we go, here we go. Working hard, you got this. Nice, you got 20 more seconds, all right? Wherever you're at, 20 seconds. Good. Again, keep the shoulder blades back. Good. Come on, guys, keep working. You only got a minute of it. Good, you got five seconds. Keep working. We got some mountain climbers coming up. And relax, good job. Mountain climbers, so let the plank our hands are going to be on the ball, okay? Your choice as to what speed you want to go to. All right, you can be here, all right? Or you're here, all right? Really important, 
Keep that ball in line with those shoulders, right? Not out too far, not in too far, okay? One minute, you get it? And here we go. Again, no medicine ball, you're doing regular mountain climbers. Okay, so in and out, drive those knees. Remember, the ball is just gonna challenge your balance a little bit. Really gonna focus on getting engaged in that core. Again, you can be here. Slow yourself down, right? Or you're here. Here we go. Nice. Come on. Drive in. Remember, try to keep that back and butt straight as much as you can, all right? So not like this, all right? Keep it down and in. Here we go. Let's see what our time is. Oh, yeah. We got 20 seconds, all right? 20 seconds. You can do this. Remember, you're only doing it once. All right? You can do it. Anything for 20 seconds. Nice. Push here. Good work, good work. Come on, challenge yourself. It's Friday, we got a weekend coming up. Three, two, one, and relax. You're gonna flip on over to your back. All right, roll a diamond chest press. You're gonna hold the ball like this. You're gonna come down and press up. All right, so a little chest press. This one, I want you guys to go quick, okay? So, down here, all right, up and down. So you're kind of making a little diamond triangle with your uh, with your fingers, all right, as you hold the ball. You're coming down and pressing straight up. All right, work that chest as fast as you can for one minute. Here we go. You got this. If you want to hold the hip bridge, hold the hip bridge, okay? Again, pushing up, down. Bring that weight towards your chest, all right? Don't slam your chest, all right? Straight up, straight down. Quick reps here, good form. Again, if you're holding that hip bridge for an extra challenge, Squeeze those glutes and hamstrings. Come on. Good. Breathing here. You got this. All right, we're halfway. Come on. How many reps? You counting? All right, let's go. Let's go. There's elbows out. Pressing straight up. You gotta hold that bridge if you want to. Good. Breathe here. Come on, guys. Make this a little bit cardio movement. All right. Good. Ten more seconds. Doing that chest work. How about those glutes? Are we keeping those legs engaged? Three, two, one, and relax. All right, this is gonna be a fun one coming up. All right, we're gonna do a sumo squat with a sumo squat jump to follow. So what that looks like is you're gonna hold the ball. You're gonna squat down, you come up, your next rep, as you come up, it's a jump. So squat, and then you gotta jump. All right, so alternate between squats and jumps for one minute. You ready? Get those legs out nice and wide. And here we go. One down. And then you gotta jump. All right, regular squat. And then jump. So make sure those knees stay out, right? As you're going down, get wide. Keep those legs wide as you do that jump. Again, the weight is optional. You can always take off that weight Put it aside and just do those alternating squat and squat jumps, okay? Up to you. All right. Whatever you can do here. I don't know what I'm doing here. Doing a little pulsing. Here we go. Squat. All right. And then you got a squat jump. Good. You got this, guys. Come on. Dig deep here. Nice. A few more seconds. We've got five. Oh, yeah. I feel those legs work. Three. Two, one, and relax. All right, this next exercise is called a good morning. So, weight or medicine balls, and we kind of go rest on your back here, you're gonna hold it just like this. All right, you got a little hinge forward. All right, so slight bend in those legs. But again, you hinge and back. You're gonna work the hamstrings, you're gonna work the lower back. All right, hold that weight. Don't let it kind of fall too much in your neck. Okay, so we've got good mornings. You ready? I'll give you a little longer break that time to explain. And let's go. So back here, bending over, back. All right, so good morning. All right, so it's not a full deadlift, all right? But you're still hinging at the hips. All right, keep that weight behind you. 
Yeah, if you don't have the shoulder mobility to hold that weight behind you, just put those arms right across or right behind your head. Right, coming down and up. So keep that core tight to protect that low back. You're gonna feel that low back work. Good, we got 30 seconds left. All right, so again, find your breathing here. Whew. All right, so down, up. Butt those back. Slight bend in those legs. You got it. Keep that core going. Awesome. Good job, good job. Five, three, two, one, and relax. Great job, guys. We got four more exercises. This one, just like we finished that last round with, we're gonna hold, but we got butt kickers, all right? So you're gonna hold that weight as we got our butt kickers. Again, as fast as you can. Get those heels towards the butt. Weight is optional as always, okay? You ready? 60 seconds. Here we go. So again, I don't want you resting that weight against you. Keep it out. Doesn't have to be too far, but again, right here. Hold 90 degrees. Here's those biceps a little bit, right? Light on those toes. Good job. Come on. Good. Here we go, here we go. Nice. Good job, good job. Keep pushing. Hold here. Come on. Woo! Keep going. Dig deep. Remember, it's the only time we're doing this exercise. Let's go, let's go. Hold that weight. Nice. Almost there. Keep that core engaged, stand tall. How's that weight feeling, yeah? Good, 10 more seconds, okay? You can do it. Good. Nice, three, two, one. Woo, all right, nice job. All right, let's shake out those arms a little bit. All right, shake them out. What do we got here? Okay. We're gonna do some wood choppers. So, looks like here. All right, coming down and around. All right, a little rotational core. But again, got some cardio in it. So you're reaching for your outside of your hip, all the way across to your upside, or outside that opposite of our shoulder. Oh, I know my joints, all right? Okay, so we're gonna do half on each side, 30 seconds. You ready? And here we go. So. Slight bend, you're coming up and around. Drive the core, so you're gonna feel it. Here, those obliques, right? So focus on those muscles as you are rotating. All right, come down a little bit, up, and here. Good, so again, we're gonna do 30 seconds each side, do two more, and then, here we go, let's switch. All right, we got the other side. Down and around. Nice job. Keep pushing here. Drive. Good rotation. Nice and controlled. I know, it's a great arm workout too, right? Good. Almost there, guys, got 10 more seconds. Nice. Good. Come on. We got three. Two, one, and relax. All right, we're gonna do some shuffling. So, what I want you to do, you're gonna carry this ball to one length, put it down, shuffle back, shuffle back to the ball, and then carry it. So, it's gonna look like this. You're holding, shuffle, put it down. All right, then you're back, and then you pick up the ball, put it down. All right, so you're picking up every other time. If you wanna hold that ball the whole entire time, be my guest, you hold that ball, all right? So shuffling, passing that ball, or transferring that ball side to side. You ready? And here we go. So bring it across, drop it down, over. Stay low as you shuffle, all right? So keep those hips square. Pick up the ball, transfer it one length before you go to the other side. Good, come on. Keep working here, you got this. Pick it up, hold it close, set it down. You're doing great. Same with that dumbbell, right? Just transfer that dumbbell side to side. Ooh, feel those legs work. I'm feeling it. 
Come on. Nice job. Here we go. Here we go. Dig deep, guys. 15 more seconds, all right? 15 more. Good. Come on. Heart rate's up. Pick up that ball. Put it down. Good. Three, two, one. And relax. This music just like counted down for me. Alrighty. This is it. This is your last exercise here for the day. Alright? So, what I want you to do here. Grab the ball. Clear some space. Alrighty. We're going to make some circles. So, hinge at the hips. Alright? All the way up. And around. Alright? So again, a little core. But again, we got a little hinge of the hips as you go down. Coming around, full circles, 30 seconds each side, and then we're done, okay? You guys are crushing it. So, let's finish strong, watch the ceiling fans, things like that, okay? You ready? One minute, I'll let you know when we are halfway, we're circling over you, hinge the hips as you go down. Ready? Let's begin. Let's come all the way down, a little hinge. Again, control here, all the way up. All the way down. Same with the dumbbell. All right, so stand tall. All right, from the side here. Good. Nice. Come around. Good. A few more seconds on the side. Reach that ball up. You ready? Let's switch directions. Hope you're not too dizzy or anything. All right. Coming down. Keep the core tight, right? Protect that back. Up and around. Good. Get low. Coming up. Nice. Good stuff. Come on. You got 10 more seconds, all right? 10 more. Give me all you got here. Let's finish strong. Good. Three, two, one. And relax. Alrighty. Nice job. Good stuff. How are we feeling? I'm like sweating, man. I'm like dripping. Good workout. How do you like the medicine ball? I liked it. It was something fun, something different. Get some water, okay? And then we're gonna stretch a little bit, all right? So a few little sips here. Thanks for coming out. I appreciate it. It's a good workout. Whew, yeah. Again, something that's, listen, medicine balls aren't too terribly expensive, but again, you can use a soccer ball, things like that. Have your kids do it, you know? Always a good thing. I love when you can use, other than like, if you don't have a medicine ball, you can use any type of uh, item in the house, all right? Man, let's just do a little forward fold, by the way. So, here's some just bend forward. Maybe reach for those toes, but I just want you to just hang in here, all right? Stretch out the back, all right? Let your shoulders hang. Shake them out maybe a little bit. We did a lot of holding, carrying that ball, so maybe you'll be a little sore tomorrow. All right, we're just holding here. All right, I want you to interlace those hands behind your back, and you're just pressing up. All right, sorry, actually, you're going to palms up here, all right? So just interlace those hands, stretch the chest out a little bit. Good, and release. You're going to interlace and push away, push towards the floor right in front of you here. Good, let's slowly stand all the way up here. Nice, give those shoulders a little roll back. Alrighty, let's get those quads. Oh my gosh. I'm like, but, well, I hope you guys have a great weekend. If you are watching this on a Friday. If you're not doing this on a Friday, people on YouTube watching it or whatever, hope you have a great day. <laughs> yeah, we're, it's our last uh, trip up to the mountains before my sister goes to college, so it'll be a nice weekend. Alright, let's switch legs. And if you are sore anywhere else, Please feel free if you have questions about what to stretch, how to stretch it, you can add it in the comments. You know where to find me, but again, you can do your own thing here too as well. Just take a few seconds, we just wanna bring that heart rate down, right? Good. Let's do our windmills. So, legs out nice and wide, arms out. We're gonna reach out, I want you to hold for a second, and then come back up, and then to the other side. Good. Reset in the center, other side. So again, just hold for a second, Good. Nice. One more on each side. Good job, guys. Yeah, that heart should be coming down. 
Good. Let's bring that arm across our chest. So my arm's a little sore from, I think, well, maybe yesterday's strength class. But again, we did a lot of holding that ball, so it might feel a little tight here. And you can roll that wrist out if you want to. Good. Let's uh, do the other arm. All right, so bring that arm straight across, that nice stretch in the back. Always my favorite. Ooh, I'm gonna go jump in the pool after this. Good. All right, hand, pull out in the back. We're gonna hit, oh boy, hit the fan, hit the triceps. All right, again, stand tall. Good. Nice. And we're gonna switch here. Ooh, yeah. Heart rate's coming down. Good. All right, we're gonna hit those hamstrings next. So I want you to kind of get that foot, the one leg up front, heel on the floor, toes in the air. You're gonna reach down. Ooh. So again, wherever you are at, sometimes some people might be able to reach their foot, other people may not be able to. You can always put that foot flat on the ground too for a little deeper stretch. Good, all right, let's switch sides here. So one leg, other leg out front, reaching down. Again, find where you would like to put your foot. Good, and slowly rise on up. Let's just do some hip openers, all right? So we did this, I think, maybe yesterday, but I love this one. So just a good one to kind of really just stretch out those hips, all right, get them opened up here. Standing tall, kind of coming in and out and around. And we're gonna do reverse. So you're gonna come back into the center. So you can hold put your hands on your hips, you can hold a chair if you need to. Good. Nice job. All right, guys, we're gonna finish. Oh my gosh, sweat just like dripping my eyes. Whew. All right, we're gonna finish with a deep breath. Inhale, reach those arms up. Maybe add a little baby back bend. And let's finish all the way down to the ground. Good. And inhale, rise all the way up. Arms up overhead, we're gonna lean to the side. And then inhale back to the center. Exhale to the other side. Good, all right, bring it back here and release. All right, guys, that is all for I, I have to read for you today. Go enjoy your weekend, go enjoy your Friday, all right? Have fun, get outside, enjoy the weather. Hopefully it's good weather for us this weekend. Thanks again for coming, I appreciate it. Again, you can find this on YouTube, watch it anytime, you can find it on my channel, share it with your friends, and I hope you have a great time today, okay? Good stuff, again, thank you. Have a great rest of your day and weekend. I will see you next time. And until then, keep going.